uh, some of the things aren't very important. They're the things that, I, uh, that came for me because uh, uh, the factory of the eccentric actor was, it was a group of really of actors, but then they went into filmmaking in the Soviet Union in the very early, w the wonderful days when art was very free and, and great things like that. And it all began really when they published their manifesto, their eccentric manifesto. And uh, you, you can see that in one of the cases. Um, they were extremely young in 1922. Uh, none of them was more than, was 20, yet 20 years old. And so I was able to know them many years later in the 1970s, 90, uh, uh, 60s and 70s. And they were still quite young men. I mean, they were, they were not, not yet 60 and they were, um, you know, they were, they, they were still working and they were very lively. And so uh, I have some things from them and many, many memories from them, which is why I particularly wanted to do it this year. As to Shostakovich, um, the film which we opened the festival with, New Babylon, uh, I think is their greatest work. It's a wonderful work, a silent film. And um, they were very young, uh, they wanted to have music for it, and they found this equally young composer. He was 22 years old, Shostakovich. He understood films very well because he'd been a, he'd been a, a pianist in cinemas. I mean, he'd, that, that's how he'd lived, by, by going every night and playing for the silent films. So he understood film music, but, uh, but in a, an extremely intelligent way. And uh, so, so this was a marvelous marriage. And, uh, it, I think that the, 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 together the film and the score are absolutely unique and um, we have in fact similarly some pages from the original score in various stages and one can see where uh, these crazy boys right at the end they, suddenly, they were suddenly so excited by what they could do with the music in the film that they, they, that they cut out a lot of story and concentrated it and poor Shostakovich who was then pretty ill with a terrible flu at 40 degrees had to quickly revise it, and, and so uh, these pieces of the score, you can see where he's crossed things out, where he's made notes. Um, certainly for a musician, they're very exciting. I think for everyone also, we have it not written by Shostakovich, but written by a copyist, but we have the, the, the part for the first violin, which was used at the, the first showing in 1929. So they're, they're, I, I hope people take note of them, because they're, they're, they're very interesting things, and they, they won't see them all together again.